Welcome to this demo, which is available on Cisco's dCloud. This is the topology uh, based on the dCloud demo. A robot server is on the bottom, and Viral is running XR, uh, simulating routers. Anstable and Docker is over on the left and right, and the workstation. Uh, is what we remote desktop into so we can get access. So we're going to do a very simple demo, taking a router out of service then putting it back into service. So let's have a look at the user interface. You can see a map on the left hand side and it's of the San Francisco Bay Area. And we have four routers, one at San Francisco, one at San, San Francisco Airport, one at Fremont, and one at Milpitas. So this gives you a nice topology and uh, sets the scene for the uh, demo. This pane shows recent activity and some quick links to various uh, other screens. The recipe library is a list of instructions that are built so the system can go off and uh, follow those instructions and the very first one uh, you can see here is um, basically installing a, a software maintenance unit a SMU onto an XR device it's an NCS 5500 and um, you have a breakdown there pre-maintenance, maintenance and post-maintenance and it shows you the steps that each uh, sequence of instructions go through so that um, you'll be able to understand what's going on. The beauty of this of course is you don't have to have any command line interface interaction and um, this can be these recipes can be built by skilled operators and given to um, or in fact you can even run them right away or you can put them into a schedule and, and run them uh, at another, uh, a future date and time. So for our demo we're going to do something nice and simple and that's uh, uh, take the adjust the IGP node cost uh, routing cost so that uh, we can take the router out of service uh, and back into service. So I'm selecting this particular recipe. Once you've selected the recipe you select the device, in this case we're going to go for the airport router and then schedule it. This is the router we'll be playing with, the San Francisco airport and the I've selected this impact analysis detail um, probably not that needed here because we're going to be taking the uh, effective for taking the router out of service but I left it in to, to give you an idea you have a current map and a, and a forecast map at the bottom and the idea of here is to show you um, what the effects after your changes will be on the network. Um, of course after the, the forecast will be back to green because the end of the recipe puts the node back into service so it's rather arbitrary. Anyway we'll run the run it now and uh, you can see the two tasks there. Um, here is a because there's the route is going brown now because we're into the uh, into the recipe, it's running the recipe. This is the traffic flowing in and out of that particular router and the, you can see the traffic flow is in a downward spiral because um, we're taking the uh, node out of service. So this should go uh, to success in a moment. It's in progress. This is the first step. When you hover over those lines, you get a 
you can see there that it shows you the uh, individual uh, there we are, success. So now we're out of service. And now it's going to step on to uh, putting it back into service in just a moment. You can also look at the events, the date and time when these events are initiated. And, uh, console is really just showing you when the program activated, not, not the console to the, to the router. You can see the traffic now coming back up on the bottom right. So it looks like we're now getting towards the end of the test. Thing to remember here, of course, it was a double click and off it went. There we are successful, so we're now finished. So, so no CLI, no command line interface, and um, automated the whole job. And that's the power of this. You can build complex recipes and um, have them run at certain times and you know uh, it's going to run okay because you've presumably tested it before. Okay, that's the end of the demo. Thank you very much.